side effects the procedure might have had. No one's ever done this before. No one's ever done this before, eh? Welcome back, everybody. I just Hello. got out. Uh, I have this burning feeling inside my skull. It's like it's on fire. Do you think there could be new superpowers? Hmm, I hope so. I think it's going to take a while before we find out. It's true. It might take a little while to manifest. It certainly took a little bit for it to all work out with the whole cryogenic but. freezing thing. We got what we needed. But this is good. This is good. This is important. This is this is significant. Yeah. Their greatest secret has finally been revealed. Where do we go next? Hmm. That seems reasonable. That scientist Kellogg was supposed to track down. Virgil. We need to find him. You're right. A rogue institute scientist could answer all kinds of questions. Yes. Where did the memory say he was? The glowing sea? That kind of makes sense. The glowing sea. We need to find Virgil. Then I'm going after him. If you're going to go, be prepared. You'll need some way to combat the radiation. Oh yeah, I can combat the radiation. Yeah, like, all right. Like being invincible? Because that's a thing. Find a way to get through the reds. Don't worry. Good luck. And be safe. Thanks, Amari. I unplugged Mr. Valentine foot. Removed. Get out. Get out. Hey, look at that. Level up. Yay. We're, we've Yay, leveled everybody. up a few times, actually, since the last time we uh, actually spent All right, all right. Maybe points. we should level up before we continue. All right. Uh, level up four. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Said we have you know, being invincible and infinitely strong makes it a little bit harder or a little bit less of a like a, a big deal. Oh wow, there's more. Uh, there's more stars for bloody mess. Oh, you just do more damage in combat. That actually might be, might be nice. Yeah, we're definitely doing that. We're definitely taking that one. Except. Yay. All right. All right. Okay. Um, uh, oh, more yeah. punching? 40% 40 per, 40 more damage. There you go. More effective yeah. punchins? Yep, yep. Yep, yep, yep. Rooted. Uh, I don't know why I took one no, of those. Why did we take those? I think that might have been a mistake. Could have been. Just between you and me. Mm-hmm. Did we uh did we take Black Widow that does extra damage to male characters? Yeah. Did we? Oh, there it we is. Did. Yeah. Is there there extra points to take? Cuz that's more damage. Bingo bango. There we go. One point to go. And 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 um huh. 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 We do we you know, do I so just... little more. I know. We we're just kind of, that's kind of all we do. mm mm-hmm. Mhm. Um, I wonder, I wonder. You could put points into a stat. Oh, uh, they're pretty, they're all pretty low. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm going to jack up my charisma, maybe. There you go. She's been working hard at being more likable, so. Yeah. That makes sense. What? And I don't need luck. Look at me. I'm a superhero. That's true. You're kind of already right. hit the hit the jackpot, all things considered. It's true. There he is. Nick. Hope you got what you were looking for inside my head. <laughs> that was right. I should have killed you when you were on ice. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Nick, are you still in there? What? What are you talking about? Nothing. Never mind. If you say so. Anyway, I feel fine, so let's get going. I'm gonna head out on my own from here, Nick. Good luck out there. You know where to find me. I don't, but that's fine. I, do. I have no idea where to find you, other than your office. Probably his okay, office. Okay, so we gotta go find Virgil, the rogue scientist. Yay! Time to traipse across the glowing sea. Hey, you know what? I'm not worried. I'm a slooper hero. We haven't traipsed in a while, so it's going to be nice. 
It's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. Yeah. There's gonna be a lot. Oh, look at this. Hey. I'll go up there with him. Whoa. Oh, you oh. you overshot a little bit. Oh, I I overshot. Overshot. That's okay. <laughs> My old pal Hancock. Uh, <laughs> oh, that's right. What matters? We freaks gotta stick together. Alright, I'm out of here, Hancock. Yeah. We heard what we needed to hear. Freaks have to stick together. Oh, everybody out of the way. There's a robot. There's a like a kill bot just chilling in there and talking with everybody. I know. He's a freak. That guy's a freak. Fucking kill bots. Fucking what freaks. Bots. All right, so we're going to go across the glowing sea. The glowing sea. And uh, I think at this point, if you were if you were not a superhero, yeah. What well, what would you do? Uh, I believe the commonly accepted uh, solution to going across the glowing sea is to go in power armor. Because power armor this negates radiation. Armor. Yep. Yep. I don't know Just why power, power armor, armor negates nuts. radiation, but it does. Yeah, that doesn't make a heap of sense, but I guess you are sealed in. It, well, is it hermetically sealed? Uh, I guess you can walk through water and stuff like that without suffocating, so. Hey, it's daytime. Yeah. A lot of time apparently passed between when we got to Good Neighbor and came out. But that's fine. You know, it's been nighttime it's... for quite a while, so. That piece of meat had road leathers. Hey, road leathers are nice. Hey, ghoul. Ooh. Oh. Okay, I might be doing a little more damage now. Yep. Hey, hello. Excuse I just me, hope sir. so. You know, you, you got you, multiple 10% increments, so. There oh. you go. Oh, I saw bits of him in. Oh, his, his head, body exploded. Yeah, his head surprisingly stayed pretty intact. Ugh, I keep missing. That's My really their only option for survival, is, is for you not to hit them. Whoa, what happened there? Awesome. <laughs> I don't know, but that was awesome. He died, and his corpse was sitting there, and then it just turned into smoke. Haven't you guys heard about me? Yeah, seriously, I'm you'd think they would have by now. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. Oh. It kind of goes in um, in leapfrogging sort of increments, really. In Fallout 3, they kind of did the just sort of standard karma thing, right? Where, like, yeah, if you were yeah. a good guy, then you got good guy points, and people treated you like a good guy or a bad guy. Um, Fallout 2 was pretty good with their, uh, actually even Fallout 1, honestly. Um, where, like, if you were badass enough, then, like, uh, raiders and slavers and stuff like that would actively run away from you. Um, this is one of those games where no matter how, like, obviously overpowered you are, uh, and no matter how many people you've killed, and like you're in a group of, of, of like 50 <laughs> people, and you've shrugged off a bunch of bullets, and like only three of them are left, yeah. they'll just keep shooting you. Yeah, they they have no. They never fear. really learn. It, yeah, it's it's a real shame. I wish they did because there was a there was a great mod for Fallout 3 and later Fallout New Vegas um, called Mart's Mutant Mod by this guy called Martigan. Um, which uh, s started off basically just by adding a bunch of new monsters right to the uh, to the wasteland, so that you would get a little bit more um, variety. But they had a couple of cool AI mods that caused like different factions to fight against one another, which they kind of didn't do before. Like raiders would actually raid um, its settlements. And right. aside from, like, the caravans, people would actually be fighting against the raiders, and it was kind of cool. Um, and uh, they actually, like, added intelligent... What was that? That was a synth. Just saying that hello. was a synth, yeah. Um, a happy to... synth. <laughs> yep. Hello. Hey. Um, but, like, another thing that it did was um, make it so that, like, 
wounded creatures would run away and like if they saw you do enough damage to another creature they would get the fuck out of there and stuff like that it sounds like we need we need something like that for this that would be nice that would be a that would be a nice little mod to have i don't know if there is an um for uh fallout 4 but um they had it for fallout 3 and they adapted it for fallout new vegas so you know, considering that this still runs on the creation engine, all things considered, you would think, well, Fallout 3 and Fallout New Vegas were still, I think, technically Gamebryo at the time. Right. But but creation engine is just Gamebryo, right? So, And their scripting engine I don't think has changed. Like, the, the actual scripting language is, as far as I can tell, not really any different. So Yeah. Well, all right. So I, 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 we'll, we'll... I have hopes. I have hopes. Is that guy? Yeah. Okay. Wait. Oh. Okay. No. He's just attacking the dog. I'm gonna say. Wow. Baseball puns. <laughs> yeah. Seriously. Yeah. Everyone's a little lame here. Yeah. No kidding. But just because you live in a baseball field doesn't mean you have to be shitty. <laughs> Doesn't it? Well, I mean, you know, parts of your life are. Hardware town. Yeah. Yay, hardware town. Where is the nearest source of radiation? I would go that way. I think I'm going the right way. It looks like the right way. I mean, judging by the mark on my map, it's definitely the right way. Yes, yes. I said that in a, in a stereotypically Italian... It looks like the right way. It looks like the right way. Oh, hey. Hey. Oh, exploding guy. Oh, he couldn't blow himself up before you punched him. The Hulk dogs. Yeah. Wow. Got a good look at his gums before he died there. There's just a hole here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just a big old hole. Wee. Oh, right, I'm a really fast swimmer. I forgot. Oh, yeah. We might actually make some good time if we uh, stick to the water. Because for whatever reason, our swim speed is a lot better than our walk speed around recently. I don't know why. Another superpower. Yeah, yeah. ultra swimming. Hey. Phyllis Daly? I, yeah, I saw that too. What is that? What are you guys... Jesus! Yeah, jeez. Ugh, raiders! I swear to God, you. man. You guys need to l fucking wise up. See, like, that sounded like the kind of line I would I would expect to <laughs> and want to hear. Yeah. Duck behind something, idiot. Of course, you know, ducking doesn't really <laughs> help against you. <laughs> hey, the Brotherhood decided to, to come in and fly around for a little bit. Are they are they landing? Oh no, that's just you jumping up on top. Where's the last guy? I don't know. I got it doesn't really matter, does it? Oh. It seems like over there. There's something going on over here. Something going on, yeah. Oh, oh. Sperm Wheat and Butcher. That guy, took, that guy took two punches. I like how the game thought that it was going to be too much of a challenge for you. <laughs> yeah. Oh, hey. Oh, here's an exploder. Nice. I've never seen the one up close like that. He just, yeah, he just throws his hands to the side. You better get out of here, Brotherhood. That guy's gonna go back and report that. So, there's this woman, and she's wearing a sequin yeah. dress. Yeah. And. And a weird mask. And a mask. Yeah. And she's just fucking up everything. Yeah. Not, not as in doing things badly. No. Like. Hey. Hey. Hey now. You got a plastic spoon? 
Mine oh, now. Man. Yeah. There you go. Oh, it's like uh, it's like hot springs. It feels good. Yeah, I bet. Warm, tingly. Water, drink. Mmm. Yum. And what ails ya? Wow, ten rads. That's crazy. That was good. That felt good. Actually, you know what? I don't know if you are immune to radiation. Well, we'll find out. That's true. That'll be an int Well, I mean, you're not receiving regular radiation, so apparently something is stopping there. Okay, so I've learned I just can't straight Still up drink, drink radiated, radiated yeah, water. Yeah, you you can't imbibe radiation, but your body is is resistant to radiation at the very least. Okay, your, your external body is resistant to radiation. That's good to know. Yeah, yeah. Hey, what happened yeah. here? Water there reminds me of Kusatsu Onsen. Whoa! Nice. Oh, jeez, it's a rad scorpion. Hey, Rad Scorpion. All right, all right. Oh. There, there we go. Jeez. There we, we took, took care of the Rad Scorpions. Um, really? Oh, jeez. Really? Blood bugs? I'm out of here. I don't want to fight bugs, those guys. Blood bugs, flies? Yeah. All right, well, that's, uh, that's about as much time as we've got for today. We are on our way to meeting Virgil here in the Glowing Sea. But uh, thank you very much for watching, everybody. I hope that you enjoyed the show today. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed the show. I did. I did enjoy the show, Matt. I hope that you enjoyed the show. I look. This is this is checking the boxes for a lot of uh, adolescent fantasies. I'll tell you that. Oh yeah, Every, so many of them. I'm a hot indes as adolescent fantasies that I didn't know that I had. Yeah, exactly. I'm a hot, indestructible girl who could jump super high. Yep. Come on. And punches ridiculously hard, too. I explode people when I punch them. Yep. You know. You can't, you're a one punch woman. You can't beat that. Yep. You can't. Oh, and that's where we're going. Bye, everybody. Bye.